everyone and welcome back to Sopo Kesat. Recently, we have been playing Genshin Impact. It is awesome! Now, if you don't know what this is, then let me tell you. It is a game in which we explore a land, recruit characters, fight monsters, complete quests, and basically travel. Today, we are going to show you all the techniques we used to defeat the huge robot in the treasure hunt quest and the final plan which worked. Let's start. Number 1. Know your surroundings. Always check out the area where you are fighting before you spring into action or else, well, let's just say it won't end well. Hill cells are a common threat but thankfully it's pretty easy to defeat them. Here's a live demonstration. <laughs> Oh, maybe I wasn't meant for this world. I'm not done. Number two, clear your surroundings. Though helixels are not bright creatures, they do pose a serious threat when aiming for a bigger target. So the best way to win a fight is to clear the area so that you can keep your mind on one specific opponent. Helixels are bad at melee combat, so quick and disorganized attacks are sure to end their story once and for all. Number 3. Knowing when to stop. Now sometimes you have to bait yourself so that you can reach victory. For instance, you have to let your main opponent, the robot, to corner you so that you can hit its head, the weak spot. Number 4. Attacking blindly. Now after beating the robot and getting cornered, attack the head of the robot continuously, not even giving it a chance to attack you back. Number 5. Learning from your mistakes. This time was thought through and made by experience, so you might have to tweak it and make minor adjustments to make it work for you. So the best way to do this is to learn from your failures, which are all the times you had to revive. And do keep your eyes peeled for the hit you get at the time of revival. They really help a lot. Okay, so the final plan goes like this. When you start a challenge and the robot charges towards you, you weaken it with direct attack. Now remember that the robot has many powerful moves and that its power comes from its back. If there are any helichels nearby, clear them up and then charge towards the robot and weaken it. Now after weakening the robot, let it corner you. You have to be facing his head in order for the plan to work properly. So after getting cornered, a pin to the wall, aim for its head and directly attack, not giving it a chance to fight back. Eventually, the robot will lose its energy and die. You might have to do this several times before you win since there might be different circumstances. But just try to stick to this plan and things will go smoothly. So that was our plan to defeat the big robot in the Arcadian Ruins. Please do remember that this plan does not need to be followed in the exact same way. For instance, Hitting the robot without getting cornered can help too. Now we are going to show you the clip where we defeated the guard the Arcadian Ruins. Oh, maybe I wasn't meant for this world. I'm not done. You're in for a little shock. Come a little closer. You're in for a little shock. <laughs> Urine for a little shock. Yeah. <laughs> Urine for a little shock. <laughs> Come a little closer. <laughs> Urine for a little shot. If you like 
this video and found it helpful, please do give us a thumbs up. And please do share this video and also subscribe to our channel if you haven't yet. Meet you next time. Bye.